Let's understand what is arithmetic mean. Arithmetic mean of variable is nothing but the simple average of those variables. And how do you find? What you have to do is you have to take the sum of all the observations. So I'll write you have to take the sum of observations and then you have to divide them by number of observation. So if you take sum of observations and if you divide them by number of observation, you are going to get the arithmetic mean. So how do I put this uh, mathematically? Let me uh, define the variables. I'm going to say my variables are say x1, x2, x3 and it goes till xn. And let's say the number of variables or n. So when I have the variables as x1, x2, x3 till n, xn and when my number of variables or n then I can find the arithmetic mean as x1 plus x2 plus x3 it goes till xn divided by n. So this is my arithmetic mean. And if I uh, compress this as a formula, I'll, I'll write that here. If I compress this as a formula, my arithmetic mean is going to be summation of, I'm using the symbol here, new symbol, summation of i is equal to 1 to n. That is the variables starting from 1, 2, 3 till it goes to n. So summation of x which is represented by i and i is nothing but 1 to n. So this makes only the summation. Then we should divide it by the number of the variables. So in the front I will write 1 by n. So it is 1 by n into summation of i to the i from 1 to n x i. So this gives your arithmetic mean and if I simplify this arithmetic mean is nothing but summation of x divided by n. It is summation of x divided by n. Here the summation of x denotes summation of each and every items or variables divided by number of those variables. To understand this let me give you an example. Let's say you have the numbers like 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. And if you want to find arithmetic mean, I'll write arithmetic mean is 1 by n and the formula says summation of i is equal to 1 to n and xi. Okay. So here i is nothing but these items. Okay. i is nothing but these items. And how many numbers you have? You have 5 numbers. So when I put, put the formula I have 5 numbers, so it is 1 divided by 5, then summation of i is equal to 1 to 5 because I have 5 numbers and it is summation of basically xi, that is I have to sum these numbers, right? That is 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus 10, right? So this is my arithmetic mean and for arithmetic mean I am going to use a symbol and that is nothing but x bar because here I am aggregating the x items and I am dividing it by number of items and this x bar is going to represent my arithmetic mean. So let's see how much my x bar is 1 by 5 into the summation of these items is going to give me the value as 30. So now I get x bar is equal to 30 divided by 5 and I get my arithmetic mean as 6. So what is this? This arithmetic mean of 6 denotes it is the average of these 5 numbers. You have 5 numbers and its average is 6. So that's what we find in arithmetic mean. But you also have got a shortcut method for finding arithmetic mean which I'll take you in next session.